Electric Adventures here with a quick update. The arcade machine is back in the house. So, um, the line hasn't died yet. It does have some, um, you'll be able to see here, a bit of a dark and some streaks. So they're probably going to have a little bit of adjusting, which they could have done. Apparently they swapped out the monitor board completely. They tried to fix mine good. Um, so I might have to do a bit more tweaking. Um, now, let's play a game. I've also given the um, controller a little bit of a spray. Now, this is the um, <coughs> 48 and one uh, pirate one, so... Hopefully that's loud enough to... So as you notice, there's a fair bit of tearing in this one. It depends on the game and what the backgrounds are like. So as I've said, I do intend on getting a real um, Time Pilot PCB because this is you know, a, a pirate emulated version and the sound is just not quite right. Times. Oops, that's my mistake then. I am sitting down on a stool, so I'm not standing up in the way of the screen, too. So normally I'd be standing up, so tears were worse on this color background. And I do notice there is a bit of a um, burn in shadow on here, so I'm not, I don't remember seeing that before. So I don't know whether they've actually swapped out the whole monitor. So it looks like the burn-in says gun smoke. You probably can't see that, I can from my angle. Which is still a little disappointing. <clears throat> but I suppose Vegas can't be choosers. Um, when my electronics friend has some spare time, you might better come around and do some tweaks or suggest some things we can adjust. Seems to be worse on some screens. Oh, the helicopter squadrons as they're quite spread out. <coughs> and if you're going for the parachutists as well. Be extremely difficult to get them at that time. That's close. So, up to the maximum points on the parachutes. We've just shot the last helicopter, too, so the Problems will stop coming. Snuck in an extra one there. Oh. <coughs> Fly around the bullets, yes. <coughs> so, this is my second game since playing uh, turning it on. You can see my first game there, 152 300. I actually did get up to the UFO level. And that was with the controls still sticking. I seem to have fixed the stickiness. I think. Very important in time pilot to be able to fly around in a circle, especially on 
these levels. Oh, missed on that. <clears throat> I'll probably hex myself now. The um, guided rockets are a lot more persistent on this level. Oh god, I've got a squadron. Right. <coughs> Sorry, not much speaking there. Lots of intense concentration. It's obviously dark background games. Obviously we don't have a problem with that. So this is the UFO level. Very... Well... Disconcerting. Because the uh, bullets are quite different that they're shooting at you. Lucky I've built up a bit of a bank of lives here. <clears throat> now, intense concentration of course. Oh! Ah. Okay, last life. Not many more UFOs to go, but the intensity on this screen seems to ramp up the closer you get to the big UFO. That's handy. And there we go, that's actually the first time I've done that for a while. Seems sort of sedate when we get back to here. So, the main, I mean, this is the real point scrubbing screen. It's a lot easier to take out the squadrons and then gradually build up the parachutists. But it does seem the planes do seem to be coming out a bit faster and it hasn't taken anywhere near as long. <coughs> so here we go, let's see how the planes are. Second time around. They are shooting a lot more. She got the spot on that time. So again, grumpy, which usually means it's time for a... Oh! Oh! Get your point grabbing there rather than going for the big ship and gets himself killed. Actually, the highest score we've got for a while. Oops! Ah, didn't, didn't dodge soon enough. <coughs> Losing my touch now.
hasn't even unintentionally got the squadron there. so much difference playing this game with real arcade control. Oh! Ah. <clears throat> so, sorry this video is going on a bit and that I've quietened down. This is quite literally the highest score I've got so far. So 296, 600. Um, <clears throat> Possibly have to check the settings, but obviously I'm um, starting on easy. So put the old initials in. So, RK cabinet. Back in the house. Some minor monitor adjustments needed. Um, <clears throat> you know, maybe you have to do some minor repairs on it now, but I've got it back and it's been playing for quite a while and hasn't gone off, so I'm happy. At least it's back and I can actually play it and practice for PAX. Us, uh, Melbourne. Alright, uh, it's Electric Adventures. Thank you all to my subscribers. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you all later.